the Miami vlog baby so we've been in Miami for a couple days it's been quite overcast and we've just kind of been settling in look at how much stuff we've got another load to come all the stuff for our we glow event which is happening on the 1st of April um, thank god we have the apartment we do that's able to keep all this stuff and then bring it up here because oh my gosh it's a lot of stuff but yeah i just did a workout we're currently going to the miami strong gym which is good and we did a workout with orena who i followed for ages and all you guys have said to me as well that i should meet up with her while she's here and she's really really lovely just how i hoped and expected her to be so that's really nice um yeah we did a workout we trained basically the same so that was a good workout it was a very similar one to what i actually did yesterday apart from um i just did a, a lot shorter time and then alex worked out with her husband which looked good and intense yeah, it was a very really good workout actually it looked like it, was it. massive yeah it looked like you guys were getting competitive at the end so that was really really nice and yeah we're basically um got a meeting in about 20 minutes i'm gonna shower have a bit of breakfast and then we need to tan to be fair she said to me that i was tanned and i was like this is so pale for me i don't i was like just you wait until i actually see the sun but yeah also if you don't follow orena you should definitely go and give her a follow because she's so so lovely um and she's had two babies um she's had one two months ago two months ago, two months ago and she oh looks God, like that she's a joke ridiculous like his reaction ridiculous i'm wearing the silhouette <gasps> you know girl um the girl who works in the gym came up to me and asked me where my my outfit was from oh really yeah oh that's cool and i was like what well, as like what did you say and then she's like what and i was like seffy s-e-f-i and then she's like oh my god it's so nice i was gonna ask you yesterday with your outfit as well and i was like yeah it's seffy and then i was like it's actually my brand <laughs> what did she say she's like oh my god amazing and i was like thank you I just got embarrassed and stuff, but it's ridiculous when that happens. I was just like, oh, Mingo, thank you. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, ciao. It is now quarter to one. Yet to head out. We've just finished up the work. Also making lunch now. And I bought bloody plant-based tuna, and it tastes not good, actually. My adapter has not arrived yet, and I need it for my hair, because we're going to an event tonight, and I can't have my hair looking like shit. I've gone for this lilac top, this because it's a great one for sunbathing in, and then this one because I feel confident and comfortable, and that's what we're about today. We're off to the beach, and then these are from Ibiza, these are Russell and Bromley. <laughs> Sweet potato, chicken, vegetables. Very, very, and what did I do to the chicken? Very English dinner, I think. We got to vlog when we were at the beach, but um, we just sat, enjoyed ourselves, and Alex got pooed on by a bird. And then we're back here now, and then I'm going to get ready and um, go to an event. But my Dyson, I actually don't know what to do. The adapter doesn't work. Like, I can't dice on my hair. Anyway, you can tell I'm very upset and Alex has given me no sympathy. Honestly, look at all these boxes and we've got about double the amount coming. It's crazy. Um, this is what I've gone for. I've gone for my wedding earrings because they're cute and classy. And then I've gone for the Norma Kamali jumpsuit. I really need to buy a new one because I'm wearing this one out so much. Um, that it'll get to a point when it will be like so bobbly um i won't be able to wear it again and i need to reinvest in another one because i feel like i'll be wearing this when i'm like 50 60 70 80 if i'm lucky enough to get there and then i'm wearing my jimmy chews and then this bag which is my birthday present from some friends last year still upset about the dice and hence this hair i don't know if i'm gonna be really overdressed I feel like I potentially could be, but better to be overdressed than underdressed. Take it. Uh, my back. I think I need to do that little strut before we leave, actually. Uh, I'm just going to make some hot lemon water. Just waking up. This little kettle's 
So I have to microwave my water to make it warm. I just don't understand why you guys don't have kettles here. We're now heading to Le Gym. This is my fit. Let me just break it out for you. Well, this is Levi. This is Sweaty Betty. Gone for flares, which is this is Sefi. This is this is Sefi. This is Coral. We're going to the gym. again I'm sorry I'm sorry you're gonna get more it's gonna be a birthday vlog which is gonna be very cute technically my birthday in the UK now and Alex okay, is cooking yeah. me dinner the naked chef oh we are really living on the edge here people oh my god Alex also burnt his back but you can't tell, it's been quite brown now. Oh, bloody hell, bend over, why don't you? Well, what are we cooking tonight, Alex? Um, tuna steak, tuna steak and chips, cheese, and favourite stuff. All my favourite things. You missed that. Tuna steak. Also, Oriana has saved my life. I will never be able to repay her, ever, because she is letting me borrow her Dyson. Just mind blown. She's incredible. And I will never be able to repay her because that is priceless. <gasps> I was just like, I love you. I love you. Making mushy peas, which is my favorite. Got the peas, steak, sweet potato fries. Got the mushy peas. Because your birthday, I got yours in the shape of a heart. Did she? Yeah. I asked to cut it specially. <laughs> <laughs> We're now going to take you guys to the Amazon lockers. Alex was very excited when he came back up from it yesterday, so I'm very intrigued. He was like, we've got to get this on camera. We've got to get this on camera. Look at this as well. Check, check, there's nothing left in there. Again, again, I'm just, again. I'm left to right. Right. Left. Got my notepad so I can make notes and write out my workouts. Also, bought this almond milk. Because you know how I love Rude Health almond milk, but they say basically don't have it in the US and they don't ship it, etc, etc. So I was trying to find a really sweet one, but this one is, it just tastes like ice cream. Some of the goods we got today at the supermarket with a little shop. Oh, we're going to be next level with that one or not. Mm -hmm. Nom, 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 nom. Like, oh, there you go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Nobody can never can do a self, selfish wish. Otherwise, it doesn't come true. two hours with them in the gym on the Monday. Um, yeah. So they can get individual stuff as a priority. No, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> We're just running through the last two days, basically. Nice. The Sunday and the Monday of um, all the content and everything we're getting with the girls. So everything is... Bish bash bosh. Boom. Bad. Boom. Yeah. I don't have a meeting with Grace Girl on my birthday. This night in here is naughty. Um, I've just finished a run and now I'm going to film a couple of workouts for you guys. So I'm just going to change my outfit. <laughs> Alex just need me a lovely breakfast. 
Been to the gym? Been to, well, I did a run. Did a run? And then I yeah. just did a little bit of filming. Um, so feeling good, and then we're gonna head to the beach. We literally got our walk. Uh, I've done the legs twice in four days. I did my legs twice in five days. Quite heavy. Yeah, I didn't go heavy. This is what I'm wearing. This is Verge Girl. This is Riot Swim. This is screenshot that. And then this is Max Mara. Um, and then these are Birkenstocks. Oh, and these are Valera. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Birthday now, but little olives, peppers, and turkey, mayo. That's umbrella, these things. What is that? Like sweet, spicy peppers, aren't they? Delivering to Ori and her husband. Um, they're a bit hungover, so that and cake because he doesn't like cake. Alex is going to go grab it for me. I'm going to go wash my hair. I'm currently naked behind the camera. Oriana, I love you forever and ever. Just making myself a matcha as well because we got a long night ahead of us baby we got a long night ahead <laughs> yes and then i'm gonna do a little get ready video with me i think for instagram slash tiktok um of my makeup look so i didn't have a lot of time on my hands i'm not gonna lie to you people Where the fuck did i put my mug there it is heated the milk already in she goes Mm -mm. Batch is about to die, but get ready for this birthday transformation, people. Bam, bam, bam. This is what I'm wearing, which is kind of cute. I was wearing something else and change, but me and Alex are basically matching. Probably won't vlog whilst we're there because, um, you know what I'm like. Watching Guy Gerber. No idea. Watching. Watching. <laughs> no, we're not watching him. We're not watching him. Can you guys tell that I'm really into my music and DJs? I'm just not cool enough. I really hope they have words. I need words, otherwise this is gonna be a struggle for staff. <laughs> Morning. We're gonna end this vlog with a morning. Yeah, how much have you got on it? Oh, oh, there's plenty. <laughs> I guess my heated, <laughs> my heated water. When we've done it. Yeah, you have. You left, you left it in the flat. And we've just gone out. No. When we did take it out, you didn't. We didn't use it. <laughs> We just came and used it when we got back in the flat and said, we've been here. Yes, so today will be the last day. And come out with us. you're going to come out, you are going to come out with us. going to give a run and then it's going to be a little bit of a run. content day, I think. Run at the gym, more of a planning day, I think. A bit of a planning, planning plan of action and some content. It's Saturday. I'm just having some hot lemon water. I'm going to make my matcha. And, uh... That's what we're gonna do, kids. Back from the beach. And yeah, basically protein chips. They're not soft, soft, soft. But they're made out of chicken, chicken. egg whites. And chicken bone broth. Mm. That is them. I actually prefer the other ones. But I prefer my toys. Say hello. Bye. Bye bye. Hey. I've just made myself this coffee shake with this, that, ice. I will do a taste test. I feel like it will be... Mmm. Oh shit, that's pretty good. Bit of coffee, wake up and work. Some tunes on and we're gonna get going because we're going out to that baby. Go, go, go. Just met a lovely girl in the park as well, didn't we? Yeah. Which I forgot to take you guys with me to the park. We went to the park. This is the park we just went to. There. So right outside. And I suggested doing a workout with some people just saying, I'm going to be here if anyone wants is joining. And she said, oh, I'd be keen. Um, although I look like this. I literally went out like this and I went, I bet 
I wouldn't know. Likelihood of someone seeing me is very slim. Oh, I was wrong. Because my tits, because of my period, are huge at the moment. So they're spilling out. And I was like, I'm sorry. I know you see me naked on Instagram, but this is different. All right, I'm gonna get ready. Pre-workout's gonna kick in now. These boys, boys, disturb me because I am so lucky that I people would even remotely come up to me and say hello and have a conversation. So please, always, 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 always come up and say hello. Like I don't think you guys understand how much I love it, how much it like boosts my mood, everything. Um, like it's epic, um, especially like in a new. I mean, any city, obviously, but in a new city, somewhere where I don't even live and all the way like across the world, it just feels like very very surreal and so always please please I love it come up to me I know I do have a little bit of a um resting bitch face I have been told and I'm also blind obviously as you guys that wasn't even for dramatic effect as you guys know um so if I'm squinting or like look like you're looking at me and I'm looking at you like dead it's because I literally cannot even see you um so please Please do not think, oh my god, she looks moody. Um, because I most definitely am not. I just it's just my face sometimes. So yeah, always please do come up to me um, and say hello Steph. And I'll say, oh my god, hello. I'll probably at first be like, huh, what have I done? Because that's normally always my reaction to anything when anyone says my name because I used to get told off all the time at school and now I'm triggered when Anyone that ever comes up to me, I'm like, oh my god, I'm in trouble. So yesterday, I went to Gurkhyber, oh, I'm terrible, Gurkhyber, um, and I'm not gonna lie, the music, I mean, I'm literally not drinking or anything, um, and we stayed for like four and a half hours, which I actually think is pretty good going, because the music was terrible, but the people watch was great. Um, Miami is kind of... Yeah, I don't know. It is a real mix of people for sure. Multicultural, everything, which is absolutely amazing. Um, very Spanish speaking, which I didn't expect it to be as much as it is. Um, but yeah, yesterday, so we went to the event and then Ori and her husband were also there. And we went to the toilet. I went to the toilet, obviously toilets and then you have cubicles. Ori went into a cubicle. And naturally, um, naturally I just, I followed her into the cubicle. Because I was like, oh, okay, we're going together. <laughs> why, why? Well, I know why, I feel like that's a very British thing to do. And she's like, oh, okay, look at me. And then I was like, we're, and I was just like, whatever, talking to her. And she's like, this is, this is the first time I've ever been in front of anyone. Like, <laughs> not of a French or anything. And I was like, oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was like, I didn't, I didn't know. And she was like, no, it's fine. Like, new boundaries. And then, and then I got stage fright when it was my turn and I was like squatting. I was like, I can't, I've got stage fright. So I had to lay tissue paper down on the toilet and then I had to sit on the toilet with the tissue paper. And then I was like, hang on. And she was trying to tell the story and I was like, because you guys, I don't know if you guys know, but I cannot multitask, which is why I'm so bad at these things because my multitasking skills are terrible. Yeah, she's trying to talk to me and I was literally looking at her like, mm hmm. I was like, I just need to wee. And then uh, I came out and I was like, wow, that was really touch and go. That was really touch and go. But, but yeah, she was literally like, honestly, she's like, I don't even do that in front of my mum. Anything. But anyway, quite amusing because I basically really dabbled with, uh, with boundaries of new people there. But also I feel like she's one of those people who I've known for years already, so. You know, we'll let that one slide, we'll let that one slide. Alex will in white tonight. You guys, I am going to end this vlog here. We are about to go to dinner, but I am going to be starting a new one, um, which is going to be a week preparation and everything for our weekly event, etc. And just another week in Miami. Tomorrow morning, going to film a bunch of workouts as the sun rises, etc. Um, I'm gonna go and try and get a cool vibey picture now on the beach. So, if you see it, and my hair's looking like this, and I'm wearing these earrings, you know which one it was. 
anyway love you guys and if you got to the end of this vlog thank you so so much and leave a comment let me know what your favorite part was um and yeah i will catch up with you guys in the next miami vlog oh look at this sun that is very cool hasta la vista hasta la vista baby driving back now but not from the restaurant from the towing place because we left the restaurant and the car disappeared we were like there's the car's not there i'm obviously blind anyway so i was like oh, maybe it's just my eyesight and then we went no it's literally not one car left in that area and it had indeed been towed. Um, so, what did we do? Bit of despair. We went back to the restaurant and we said it's been towed. And they said, yes, it happens. We called the guys. They said $145. We said, we don't have any cash. They said, we only take cash. We said, we don't even have a card on us, any Apple Pay. So we tried different machines, no cash, no cash. And then we had to go back to the restaurant that Alex worked as ma magic. They very, very kindly, one of the guys gave us cash because we bank transferred him the money. So then we've got the cash. Oh, before that as well, we saw the van, the towing van, towing another car while away Alex ran to him and said mate what can we do maybe we could get a lift with him etc obviously we have no car at this point and then we said is it a rental and he said there's no way you can pick it up the rental company have to pick it up and we're like no it's gonna be so expensive and like wouldn't we need it back now or tonight anyway Alex puppy dog eyed him and they said okay okay we will give you the car tonight but you still need the cash you still need the cash Anyway, and that's when we went and got the cash, got an Uber to this weird little joint um, where there was lots of cars that had been towed and there was a man who looked like he was out of like a little high school musical bad boy thing, didn't he? Um, very serious and I was dressed like this and anyway gave us the car, gave him 150, and it was 145, and straight away he was like, no, uh, we don't do, what did he say? No change. No change. And we were like, whatever. But like, you know, and it's so instant, no change. But like, you are a scammer, so, so everyone, everyone pays you cash, Yeah. have no cash change. Yeah, okay. it makes total sense. Makes total sense. Um, Anyway, we then had to find our papers, which were in the car. Alex had to get his ID, he didn't have his ID on him, but he had a picture of his ID. Oh, the bloody palaver. I'm now being distracting. Um, and let's just get home, safe and sound. Um, thank you, love you.